I published the fifth book in 2011 when the series was just going on the air, so I was like five books ahead. I was completely confident that uh, I would have the entire series finished and Winds of Winter and A Dream of Spring would be out before they, uh, they got to them. Because you plan to have two more books. Two more books, yes. You, you had once been quoted saying that you would find it alarming if, uh, if they caught up, if the series got ahead of you. Well, I didn't, yes, I was, I was <laughs> it, it was a blow when uh, the series caught up. I didn't think it would happen. When it was clear they were catching up, you told them over a kind of an overarching future of, of where you saw the, the last two books going in terms of plot? Yes, and you know, the major beats. Mm -hmm. I mean, obviously we're talking here about a, a several days of story conferences taking place in my home in Santa Fe, New Mexico. Um, but there's no way to get in all the detail, right. all the minor characters, all the secondary characters. The series has, has uh, been extremely faithful compared to 97% of all television and movie adaptations of literary properties, but it's not completely faithful, and, uh, and it can't be. Uh, otherwise, it would have to run another five seasons. And, and in essence, what by the time the series is finished and your other two books are finished, you, essentially it's going to be two set different, yeah, two different versions. But you know, I think that's true of every adaptation. We got we got all these Spider Men. Um, is it Stan Lee's Spider Man from the comic books? They're they're similar, but they're also different. Things happen to one that never happened to the other. Things are resolved differently. The girlfriends are shuffled and reshuffled. Uh, the, the primary beats are there, the character is there, but it's a question of uh, with the choices you make to tell the story, which are partially dictated by your, your medium. I mean, do you worry that some fans will have Dan and David's ending in, in their mind's eye? Would that, would, that, you know, would that be a disappointment to you? I don't think Dan and Dave's ending is going to be that different from my ending because of the conversations we, we did have. But they may be on certain secondary characters, there may be big differences. And yeah, some other people will have that. There will be a debate, I'm sure. Um, I think a lot of people who uh, say, oh, Dan and Dave's ending is better than the one George gave us, it's a good thing they changed it. And there will be a lot of people who say, no, Dan and Dave got it wrong, George's ending is better, and they will all fight on the internet and there will be a debate. And um, that's fine. I mean, it, you know, the worst thing for any work of art, be it a movie or a book, is to be ignored. 